Hey guys, what's going on? So I just want to bring some attention to this. Um, I'm sure you guys already know that the MacBooks, the new ones that just came out for 2019, there was a refresh for that, and it's mainly just a spec bump. It looks like it's for just the, like added the more cores than the 9th gen, especially on the 15 inch. But um, there's something that kind of does worry me, and I really don't understand why they're doing this. But if you actually look at the keyboard service programs for the MacBooks, MacBook Air, MacBook Pro, it's listed on their website and it's for warranty. Um, if you look at the bottom here, if you see the last one of the list, this just came out and just was announced, what, uh, maybe two weeks ago, three weeks ago, a few weeks ago anyways. But they, the one that you just bought, the brand new one that just came out, the 2019 has a key, the same keyboard issues that has been going on for all the butterfly keyboards that have been released since 2015. And they actually claim there's supposed to be a different material change that's supposed to help with this. But the fact of the matter is, it's not a design change, and you still listed the one you just released on to the eligible models for the keyboard service program. That, your very expensive brand new one, a 2019, still has the same problem from 2015. You believe that. Um, so if you guys aren't aware, the 2015 models and just the ones that pretty much have all the um, the butterfly keys, they actually do have a problem, especially over time. So over time, it looks like the butterfly key design, it could be related to like dust, crumbs, or small particles that go underneath it, and also maybe some heat um, that do mess up the keyboard and cause them to fail. Um, and this has been part of that design since then, so about four or five years ago anyway. So this has been going on for quite a while. They, they choose still not to really address it with a redesign yet. So it is saying that there are, Apple has admitted that there is actually a small percentage of users seeing this problem. But still, man, do you really want to buy your 2019 MacBook Pro, all that money you just spent, that could possibly have a failure within how much time? Who knows, you know, or it could just... It's covered under warranty, so it must be a pretty big deal if they're already putting it under their service program. Um, I'm just bringing that attention to you guys. Um, yep, so just to let you guys know and everything. But anyways, guys, just bring attention to that. It's really interesting. But yep, so go check it out in the, in the service program if you decide to buy one. You can see which ones are covered actually under here. And if you can see the, even the 12-inch ones, which are the beautiful ones, I actually really like the 12-inch myself. But those actually are affected as well. And those are the first ones, but then the pros kind of got the same design after that. And, um, yep, so if it does happen to you, uh, please comment below if that does or if you've seen anything like that. What do you guys think of these MacBooks? I'm, I mean, I'm sure they are beautiful devices, but, man, they come with a lot of, lot of baggage. And you're paying a super premium for that. All right, guys, thanks a lot. And I'll leave a like down below. And um, thanks for watching. You guys have a good one.